Hello, Nomad Sculpt, and this video is uh, about aligning objects to um, along the curve. So it's not easy for me to explain it in English. So, but I try my best. So, okay. So I try to explain the problem. So, this is curve A, curve B. Uh, it's a tube profile. So you see here objects um, along the side of the curve here or the profile and in the center line here. So this is um, the starting position here. Um, both objects are at the same position here. So, but if you follow the objects here on the curve, you see here um, this object here is uh, perfectly aligned, so but this object here is moved uh, inside here, and this one is also not correct. So when you follow the the curve here, you see here a, a problem here. So this alignment here is completely different uh, to this alignment here. So but it's the same curve and the same objects and here um, you see here um, the tube also here the tube the array and the only difference is here that inside the array there's a group node this one and here the group is missing so this is uh, the big difference um, it's important to put all objects inside a group. So here in, in this example here, here you see um, the array node without a group. Um, so when you select here an object here and watch the other objects here, watch every object on the screen. So when I use now the gizmo tool, and I move this object, the other objects are also affected. So, yeah. And as long as only one object is here, so um, watch here the curve at the moment for of, of the center uh, centered objects and when I delete this one they change the position you see okay so when only one object here in the center line is um, used here like this here then it's okay then it it, it works correct but um, if only one object here is um, yeah, yeah, used, uh, then, then you can work with it, the other thing not. So when you place here now your object, one object, then the aligning doesn't work. Okay, so how to fix this problem? So here you have your your tube profile. So I select all the other things here now for the moment and hide it and only this curve is active. Okay. So check your your gizmo so or your pivot. So this is at the moment the tube and it's correct aligned. Um, this is new, I think, in version 181. The aligning in version 180 is a little bit different, but it, the workflow is the same. Okay, so at the moment I delete this one and here now, okay, again, this is our pivot for this object. And now we extract here the curve of this tube 
and here press gizmo and you see it's a complete different gizmo so this is the tube gizmo and this is the array gizmo so the the array gizmo is in direction to the to the end node here and the tube gizmo is um, in the direction sorry in in the profile so this is important to know so you have to do is um, here select your tube and create on gizmo here a group so put everything out of the group so and put also the repeater out of the group and then put the group node into the repeater node so here here is the uh, repeater pivot and this is the group pivot so when you now um, add a, a object inside the group so like a box the correct thing here make it a little bit smaller like this and bring it in position so now we have to change the the value and now here it's possible oh auto save to uh, position the, um, the objects here in the correct uh, alignment. So something like this. And when you clone this object, it affects not the other object. So only this object you use at the moment. Something like this. And yeah, a last thing here, when you um, use this, um, this profile here and you want to create aligned other tubes, so you can clone this tube and now you get um, a second profile so and you can place here the the other profile so I'll make it round in this position so when you watch here the profile editor you see here um, your profile is very small here in, in this position and when you switch to this one um, and to this you see here yeah, the positions. So this is very important um, to align the things here. So it's not possible to copy or mirror this object to this position. So you have to um, create a, a clone of this um, tube profile um, clone and then uh, do the same thing here for this one um, to create the mirrored object here so something like this So now you have um, a correct alignment of the of the tubes to the main object. Okay, I think that's it.
have fun with sculpting. Ciao.